I'm a simple guy. I like to set boulders and I like them to be weird. So today I've set one of the most paradoxical problems of my entire life. It's a competition paddle dyno into a good old fashioned hand jam. And after my initial testing, well, it proved to be a little bit too doable for me without expert help. Previous to this, me and Matilda Sutherland had been coached by none other than crack climbing expert Pete Whitaker. He challenged us to territory we'd never experienced before, and you should for sure check that out over on the Wide Boys channel. Anyways, this became the perfect opportunity to challenge him to something as well. However, Pete isn't really known for being the most jumpy sheep in the herd, if you know what I mean. And so I felt I had to ease him into it a little bit, and bring over his static crack climbing style into the more modern competition style that this boulder required. That being said, it's time to get Pete to go from our good old fashioned trad dad into that comp kid that just flashed your proj. Yeah! And he needs a natural. This is, uh, we're still not quite at any form of paddling but you do have to move like quite efficiently around here and really swing, catch, okay, and palm down. Yeah, and I wanna see springiness. You wanna see spring? I wanna see spring. I wanna see spring. <laughs> was that spring? <laughs> it, was, it was good enough, it was good enough. I think you can do it more like, so the thing with dynamic movements is that you really wanna take out the entire swing. You're kind of, you were going like right foot over, kind of crossing into it, and yeah. then you started like fake springing it a little bit to make the movement happen. <laughs> but I think you can do better. Okay. I want to see left foot on, use the momentum from the right leg. because ah, I was on right foot, wasn't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like really, you can keep the right foot there if you want, but really yeah. like charge from it, swing over, take the jug, catch. Okay. So that you're really utilizing the full momentum. So you're like doing the old kick. Yeah, yeah. The old donkey kick. Yeah, you don't really have to, but you, when you start moving up with the right foot, that's kind of how you think about it and how you use it. Yeah, yes, good. Much better, yeah, really good. Smashed it. You need to get into springiness. Uh, but yeah, I think the Lachey Dino will be, will be great for you now. Yeah, I think Lachey. So the big thing about these type of movements is like figuring out the, the vector which you, trajectory. The trajectory, that's the word. Because oftentimes people start like swinging, you know, like this. Yep. And then just go like swinging around. And it's so important to like from the get go be going in the direction, you know, where you're actually trying to land. So with this one, I would go like, it's pretty straightforward, but like really focus on where you want to land and then swing over legs first and let like the upper body. Yeah, in follow it. Yeah. Yeah. Smooth. Right. Very smooth. <laughs> like a wave. Alright. Don't want to be there. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Ooh, oh. Okay, so here's the first beginner thing. Yeah. You're trying to land left foot only. Okay. And you have to focus on the fact that you, you're, the end position is like, because you're not going to catch it like this, right? No. So you have to consider like, where, which position will you land in? And then focus on that from the get go. And they, that's going to be like, Feet on, both feet on. Yeah. So if you're shooting to just land with the left foot, the right foot's not gonna attack long well enough. Come on, crack on. Ooh. Okay. When you're actually doing the the last, like when you drop it, you can wait even longer than you think is necessary. So right now you're going, like your your upper body's not following along. Yep. In like that little upward swing at the end. And if you do that, you're gonna crack it, smash it. Yeah. Whatever you want to call it. <laughs> Can I watch you, you, you do it all yeah, the time? Yeah, yeah. Yep. Then it's swing back and then. Oh, so easy. Okay, let's go like legs. Yeah, come on, come on, commit, commit, commit. Yes! Oh, that was really good. That was, really good. that was better commitment. Yes, but here we ended up in the wrong direction. Yes. You were landing all the way out here, but you really have to be like close to the edge, but you know, on the left hand side. It's too far right. right. Yeah, yeah, you were out here. Yeah. Good. He's learning, he's <laughs> learning, folks. Oh. oh, that was better, that was better. What a guy, what a guy. Yeah, maybe this is the crux. Yeah, <laughs> could be. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah, nice. Yes. Yeah, okay. Nice one. Oh, 
Come on. Come on. Come on. Nice. You know what we're gonna do now? First paddle dino. First paddles. <laughs> Ready to go? Ready to go. Yeah. I think it's best if you try this once first and then okay. I'll show you if you can't do it. Pretty easy compared to the last one. Yes. But more, yeah, a little bit more complex, I guess. Okay. Yeah. More simple, but more complex. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> no, easy. So only easier if you do it right. Yes, exactly. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you really trying to find your static approach, aren't you? <laughs> Come on. Oh, perfect! This one's gonna be so good for you. Just start like that. And then... Okay. A little, a little, basically a little walk around with feet. Yeah. But then also like, actually paddling. Yeah. It's important. One by one. And then you just go, full value. Come on. Come in! Come in! Act. Yes! Well... <laughs> it's, like, it's like I need to be set up. Yeah. Before going. Rather yeah. than doing like so, yeah, exactly. And a good way, a good way to practice this is to don't like skip the start once, yeah, and just go like, oh yeah, okay. swing, yes, good. Yes, so good. Come on, yes. Oh. Nice. Cool. Cool. Perfect. Yeah. Right. Psyched. Next one. We've done one of these before. Um. Yeah. Rolling over. Rolling over. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on. Oh, good. Good. Good start. And if you jump with a slightly more bent up arm in the start, and then like roll over more dynamically. You'll get all the way over here, and then you have to like squeeze and be done with it. Squeeze and be done with it. Climb it very elegantly at the top, no, but it worked. It worked. And the jump, uh, it's kind of like I talked about, like really letting the tricep do all the work of regulating your movement, mm -hmm. and then pushing that energy into the hips. 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 It's all in the hips. <laughs> it's all in the it's hips. a dance. Dancing hips. All in the hips, come on. Okay. Yeah. Yes! Ooh, good. <laughs> And no. I will say, if you don't do this, it's going to be alright, because I think the other dino is of a very different type. Yeah. So we can still try the crack dino, the ultimate boss. Ooh, closing in. Good. Are you going to bring out the trad dad now? I just want to bring out the trad dad for <laughs> one, one or two goes, <laughs> just to see. Yeah. <laughs> and I jam it. That'd be something. I don't think he can though, which is good. A little knee bar or something. Yeah. Come on. You gotta yeah. jump it. I think you have to jump it, yeah. Oh. yeah. Let's move on. Let's move on. <laughs> We're moving on. <laughs> right, so oh, the trad dad couldn't hold the pinches. <laughs> no holds were too bad. But you I think you were learning the movement really, really well. So we're we're satisfied with the results we got. Yeah, I'm not satisfied. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not satisfied. In your approach to becoming a comp kid, you're doing great. Okay. Yeah. So but we'll finish it off before we get on the final boss with just a very, very typical coordination dyno, like the first one you encounter in a competition kind of. Like that type of movement. Sideways, jumping out, running on boxes. And just try and finish it off there. Cool. Yeah. Yes, yes! Ooh. Nice. Come on. So good. There we go. Easy money. Yeah. 
I think we have ourselves a comp kit ready to combine <laughs> the best of both worlds. Crack and paddle. Paddle, <laughs> <laughs> paddle crack. Paddle crack. Paddle, yeah. P paddle. Do you think you're ready? I'm ready. Let's get cracking. Well, I don't know if I am ready, but <laughs> I'm as good as ready. Come on. Yes! Yes! <laughs> that was awesome! Our comp kid is finally growing up. Oh, that was close. Oh, I had my hand in, I just didn't engage yeah. at the right time. Right there. I just didn't engage it enough. But I felt it that time. All right, Pete, you're gonna have to pick up the torch again. <laughs> oh, that was close. That was very close. Nice. Oh! Oh! oh. That was close. That, that was, was very really close. freaking close. Really close. That was like, best oh, I so could hold far. this. Yeah, best yeah. so far for sure. Yeah. Cool plan. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh! Oh! oh. oh it's, it's still difficult. Yeah. It's still really difficult. <laughs> it's still quite hard, yeah. yeah. Okay, Emil. What yeah, we we're do? we're not up to the task, so we'll add a small extra foothold to just give that slight boost in the legs, because you know you've seen his springiness; it's not epic yet. <laughs> but with this, you know, he's gonna be swinging up the wall like it's nothing. Oh yeah, this is so good. You're gonna do that. You're gonna do it. All right, Pete. Any any final words? Just bring out the sticky paws. Oh yeah? And just, <laughs> just grab that thing and then straight in there. I don't know, that's all the I'm The crackling say. goes in. Yeah. Let's get it done. Ooh, yeah, it's there. It's there, yeah, right? It's there, isn't that's it? That's right there. Easy bit. <laughs> it's not easy if you can't crack climb feet. Oh no! I didn't get the right hand well enough. Okay. So, but I thought it was good enough, but I didn't get it like all the way in. And and so when I so I was like, oh, I can move off of this. And then when I was about to move, it just wasn't enough. Good job. Thanks, man. Yeah, we might nice have one. to do it in two parts. Yeah. You do the top, I do the first part. <laughs> Nice. Nice one. Good effort. Smashed it. <laughs> Nicely done. It felt so good that time. That and was I good. I readjusted the jam. So satisfying to stick. All right, you want to give it another attempt? I'll give it a couple more guys. Yeah, we want to see you wrap it up yeah. to finish off your comp kit evolution. Yeah. So I'm <laughs> yeah. not the trad dad from now on. <laughs> Come on, throttle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Fuck you. You, you literally smashed it. I missed the crack. You literally really. smashed it. <laughs> yeah. I just hit the edge of the crack. Oh, okay, I'm done. It's over, it's finished. You sure? Yeah, yeah. Pete had to call it quits after we'd been going at it for over two hours. And uh, we also had two more videos to shoot. One where me, Matilda and Pete set a boulder that was a combination of all of our styles, making it almost the impossible boulder problem, which you're gonna see in probably in the next episode. 
And what we also did was we set a boulder that was kind of at our upper limit of flashing, but perfectly in our style and challenged the others to try and do it as well. <coughs> That's really hard for me. Now, obviously the boulders ended up being really freaking hard, despite them being at our kind of flash grade, just because we have such different styles. Sure, Mr. Black. Sure. Bye. And I'm sure you guys are not going to want to miss this because it's an absolute ultimate brawl of different styles and we get to show both the best and the worst of our abilities in it. So hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on it. I don't have... <clears throat> and on top of that, I'll see you all in the next video. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah, thanks, thanks for showing me the, uh, the comp <laughs> ways. I'm going to practice. <laughs> nice. Practice yeah. so then next time we can step it up a notch. Maybe in Stockholm, you versus Toby. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Toby would be good at this, actually. Yeah? Yeah, he'd be good at this because uh. he knows how to jam. Okay. Um, yeah. And he's, he's got this stuff dialed. Yeah. He's like the freaking dino king. So, <laughs> Let yeah, us know yeah. in the comments if that's something you want to see. Toby and, uh, and Pete in Stockholm struggling, fighting it out. <laughs> <laughs> Peace out, my homie.